The cost of living in Kenya is skyrocketing with every passing day as prices of basic commodities like foodstuff continue to rise. A year ago also, the price of 2 kg maize flour, for instance, was 1 of 5 Kenya shillings. It then went up to 117 Kenya shillings in mid-2021. Today, it is 127 Kenya shillings. Citizen Digital went shopping in Nairobi's pipeline area just to see what 1,000 Kenya shillings can buy you with the current crisis. We are here at Jacqueline's supermarket in pipeline just trying to, to see what best commodities are retailing at. Okay, now with 1,000 shillings, I've been able to buy one litre of cooking oil, you know, um, a bar soap of menengai, uh, sunlight lavender, 1 kg, and then 1 kg of ugali, uh, flour, and then, um, you know, 50 grams of arimis. I've been able to buy a few items with 1,000 shillings. Actually, I spent like 1,026 shillings. Kiongeza na mfuko. Guys, that is what you can buy with 1,000 shillings at this particular time. But now, if you have a big family and actually you want some 3 liters of cooking oil or, you know, several bar soaps or a few kgs of sugar, how much are you going to spend, you know? In fact, 1,000 shillings, you will only buy 3 liters of cooking oil. For instance, here we are. This is Ufuta pure vegetable cooking oil it goes at 970 shillings those are three liters of cooking oil so if you have a big family it means you're going to spend more and 1000 shillings is going to buy you just one product we need to hear from Kenyans what they have to say about the cost of living Wazazi wananchi mwananchi wa kawaida anaumia kwa pesa ya mfuko ana ya kutosha Ukiingia dukani ukipeana elfu moja ni kama mia moja Una, unatoka na vitu mbili peke yake hunga na mafuta Ili hali mwananchi anaumia huku serikali yetu inatumia pesa za mwanai mwananchi Ingeombelea serikali yetu ya Kenya president wetu Uhuru Mugai Kenyatta Aizo kukumbuka mwananchi ambaye anakula mfukoni. Matarajio yangu ni kwamba vitu vya basic commodities zikue bei nafu na bei rahisi ziweze ku be accessible in the market. Kwa majina mimi naitwa Phyllis Wanjiko na mimi pia ni mfanyabiashara hapa pipeline. Mbeleni at least ilikuwa bei ilikuwa chip kidogo lakini saa hizi hata maziwa yenyewe hayapatikani. Mali unaipata unapata ya kwamba bei iko juu sana. Mkenya wa kawaida ah kwa kweli ana, anafinyika sana. Kwa sababu unapata challenge imeingia sana kwa, kwa vitu kama chakula, maziwa ndiyo hiyo ipatikani, mafuta ya chak, mafuta ya mboga ndiyo ile kwanza imekuwa challenge kubwa sana. Unapata saa hizi watu wanaishi maisha ya kujisukuma. E, watu hawafurahii maisha lakini kwa sababu you have to live kwa hivyo unajisukuma tu. 